What's up, freaks? We are getting set up here for a boot camp total body conditioning ses session. There's gonna be some strength, some cardio, some core conditioning, all parts of the body, upper body, lower body, left side, right side, upside down, inside, mother flipping out. We are gonna need some pieces of equipment. If you have these pieces of equipment, great. If not, then you just can substitute them, either use the floor or dumbbells. So you need a BOSU ball. You see little freak shows back here bouncing around on a BOSU ball. If not, you just use it on the floor or if you have a gym that you go to and use or if you have this stuff at home, whatever works for you, just follow along with the BOSU ball stuff. You don't even need a BOSU ball. You can literally do it on the floor. We're just adding it to the mix for some fun. You're also gonna need an exercise band like this attached to a pole somewhere. So this is just an exercise band with a handle attached to a pole. In addition to that, you're just going to need a monster band. If you don't have a monster band, you can just use a dumbbell. So a monster band are these right here, where it's just a big loop of a band. And then last piece you're going to need after that, very strapped. Last piece you're going to need after that is just a medicine ball or a weight. Something that... A medicine ball, really, because we want to slam it, but if you can't slam it because you don't have a medicine ball, you'll just go through the, the full speed motion without slamming it. So I'm going to give you a couple seconds to get that done while we start warming up. We're actually going to do a full warm-up for shoulders, rotator cuff, a total body warm-up while you get a chance to get yourself some equipment. Again, a BOSU ball or some substitute, a medicine ball or a substitute, an exercise band, and a monster band. All of the above. So while you get that, I'm going to start showing you how to get your shoulders warmed up with one of these exercise bands. This is a thin one, a light one. We're gonna start with the shoulder, the elbow stuck in. The elbow stuck into the side of the body, and I'm gonna rotate, come across, 90 degrees. Just six or eight of them, we don't need a ton. Whatever, six, eight, 10, whatever you feel you need to. So it's the right arm, slow it down. Right arm going in, and we're gonna flip around. Left arm coming in. Just rotate across. We're just warming up deep in the shoulder again, this arm, Warmed up, pumped up, ready to work. So this is just showing you. I, I do the shoulder workout, warm up, before every single workout. Now the right arm going out. So my elbows glued into the side. Literally, I do this before every boot camp session, whether it's cardio, boxing, weightlifting, body weight stuff, whatever it is. I will do this rotator cuff warm every single time to keep the shoulders warmed up, healthy, ready to freaking roll. Now left arm going out. Left arm going out, elbow stuck into the side. Just six, eight, somewhere around there. Done. Now right arm going forward. But before you do it, very important part of the technique. You gotta put this up overhead and stretch and say, ah. Stretch that shit out. Now go 90 degrees with the arm and it's gonna rotate forward. So the elbow straight out from the shoulder and just rotating forward. So we're hitting this rotator cuff from all different directions. And switch arm, left arm. You know the rule. Ah, shit. You should be stretching out because you should be sore from busting your ass every day. Rotate, left arm going forward. See, it's 90 degrees. Rotating forward. That band is lined up right on my, on my forearm. Can it hit you? Rotate it. And face in. Now the right arm going back. Rotate back. So this is showing you a warm-up. You can do every single workout. So we're taking the time to go through this for you today before we get into the work. We've got plenty of work to get to. Rotating back. <laughs> the forward one, dude. And left arm going back. So we get right arm in, right arm out, and left arm and right arm forward and back. So left arm going back. And done. We're gonna rotate the shoulders, fling the shoulders forward. Big, loose shoulder. Flings forward and then backwards, keeping it loose, shaking it, stretching it. Catch for a stretch. Two or three seconds. Fling it open and catch the other stretch. And catch the other side. Ow! Oh, shit. Just B I T shade slap me. Stretch it. Oh, you see that funny? Better run for your life. Stretch that shoulder one more time each side. Stretch it. Hold it. And go back to your band. 
If you have a thicker band, now you use the thicker bands. We did the rotator cuff, now we're going to do all the real movements. Single arm works better for this warm up because you can really focus on it and get enough sets. So we're going right on forward, chest press. 90 degrees. Just rotate forward, push forward. Breathe out as you're pushing forward, so get to that breathing rhythm. It's going about 10 each side. Daddy, you're crossing so no. And switch. Left arm going forward. It's too close. If this comes off, it's going to go right in your eye. You need to spread out. Bend out. Bend out, guys. Left arm, chest press. Going forward. When we're going single arm with these, our feet are straight across. They're not staggered. Drive forward. Breathe it out. In through the nose coming back. Press it forward. Just going around. Right arm coming straight back. Now for a row. Right here. Hand to the rib. Rip it back, squeeze it, control it forward. Just all the basics, get all the basic muscles. Warm the hell up before we get to work. Switch, left arm. Bring it straight back, breathe it out, rip it back. And good. Right arm. Remember some of these exercises because some of these will be mixed in in combinations of the regular, the real rounds. Right arm, chest fly. So the arm is straight out to the side. Squeezing it into the center. Center of your chest. Straight arm. And flip it around. Left arm. Mid. Okay, stop pumping into you. We're doing real set. You're in the way. This is going to hit you. Left arm. Chest fly. Arm is straight. Just to the center of the chest. Like if I was bringing two hands together. And face in. Right arm pull over. Right here, straight down, straight down to your side. Waiting time. Arms straight the whole time. Head up, chest out. Abs strong, back straight. Rip it down, other side. Rip it. Rip it. Hold with the lat, tricep. Pretend the band. Right arm, bicep, hand up to your ear. Breathe out as you're pulling back. Pause and squeeze. Resist forward. Switch arms, left arm, bicep curl. Rip it back. Boom. Stop talking. You are you the last one in your eye. Pause and squeeze. Control forward. And right arm. You notice the waist? Last one for this round, tricep kick back. Kick it. Boom. Boom. Please. Put the band down right now. Put the band down right now. Kick it back. Put it down. Stand up straight in between. Left arm. Kick back. Back is straight. Squeezing the tricep. Couple more. And good. So just to get the upper body, the shoulders, all warmed up, ready to freaking roll. All right, so check it out. You need a BOSU ball or you could just do it on the floor. The BOSU ball is just to add a little extra balance for fun if you have one, if you have access to one, if you have one at home or at the gym, whatever, where you're following along from. While we're talking here, stretch your quads out. And then you also need an exercise band, monster band, and medicine ball. All those can be replaced with literally a single dumbbell if you had to. But we want to be able to just mix it up if you have stuff to mix it up with. All right, so we're starting off. We're going right to it with a push-up with the Bosa ball. <laughs> so Bosa ball, push-up is going to lead the way. Set of push-ups is the first round, so we're doing a short set. Just maybe 10 or 12 push-ups to begin. Go on in three, two, one, go. I'll tell you when the push-ups are done. Just get what you can this time. We're all going to switch together. Back is straight. You have a post ball, we're just balancing on the ball. Breathe out, drive it up. Just getting started. Drive it. And that's good. 
First round is just short sets. Get your monster band out. It's going to be in the same order every time. A light monster band for your first round just to warm up. You're going to step on it with your both feet inside. And you can bring it up with your elbows inside, right up under your chin. If you just have a dumbbell or a ball, you can use that ever to sit in a set of squats. Oh, yeah, it's feeling good. Legs are feeling real good. After a 24-hour bike ride, I cannot feel my legs. So it doesn't even matter if I'm doing it. I can't even tell that I'm squatting. They're still numb. It feels like I'm standing still. But I'm ready to fall over my face. You would love that shit. Why did you see me fall on my fucking face? Breathe out on the way up. Into the nose down. Breathe out. Drive it. You're going to need your medicine ball next. First round, so we're just doing short sets. Time. Put that aside. Get out your medicine ball for just a regular slam. Just doing a regular slam. Wow. I see you really done a really good job cleaning the gym. Anyways. That's excellent. It's off me. Give me a wipe. We're going to do a slam with the ball. Listen, if you don't have a... Wait, if you don't have a ball, you're just gonna chop it down like this and overhead. Chop it down, lift overhead. Right there. Today, please. And begin, start, slams. It's pathetic, you're not doing your job. There's no speed, it feels entire gym is clean. You know what I'm yeah. This is perfect. I know the last second to stop the ball. Oh. Don't follow me. We just slam the ball into the vault to ball. We don't do that. Reach up. Smash it down. Go. Bam. Smash it. Ball slippery. Boom. Boom. Right there on the ground. Time! It is just the first round. You're going to be on your exercise band as you pass to the pole. Check it out. You're going to do two chest presses, two rows with the same arm. So I'm going to be right here. My right leg is going to be back on this one. This one, I'm going to have a stagger stance for a single arm. So two presses, stepping all the way back. So my left foot stays in place the whole time. Two rows. Two press. Two row. Step back. My left foot is in place the whole time. That's like my pivot point. I'll angle out here so you can see it may be different. I'm just pivoting, swinging out 180 degrees. Two rows. So the right arm is the whole time. Step back. Two press. Spin it out. Two row. Two press. Two row. Just chaining it together. If you need more tension, you just step away. Step further away. The further away you are, obviously, more tension you're gonna have. You're going about 15 to 20 of each on the press and the row. Keep pumping it, keep pumping it. Once you get in the rhythm, look, you can just keep pumping it. And time, switch to the left arm, left arm. Now the right foot is your pivot point. So the right foot's on the floor, your left leg is back, the band is in your right hand. Two row. Spin forward. Two press. Two row. So I'm stepping back for the row because the row needs more tension. Step forward, pivoting this right foot right into the presses. See so this right leg is staying in place. It's just my pivot point. Swing it out. Boom. Boom. Step. Press, press, row, row. Abs are tight the whole time, holding you together. Swiveling out. You have a good amount of tension on there. To challenge yourself with this weight a little bit, it's just a freaking rubber band. So stretch it out so you get some work. Step. Pump it, press it, boom. Two more each. And 
same time. We're on our BOSU ball for a cardio set and then for an ab set. So first the BOSU ball facing down for the cardio set. He's just going to be plank jacks. Push up position. Feet jump apart and together. Go. Hips down. Back straight. Half strong. Pump it out. 15 seconds. You don't have a bolster ball, you just do this on the floor. Bolster ball just add a little more stability work. Four. Three. Two. One. Done. Flip it over. Gently placing it down, not slamming your bolster ball down. Lower back on top. We're doing an upper crunch. Simple shit. Upper crunch. If you're head and shoulders, you'll be hanging off the edge. So it's a lot of work. You're at this bottom position, your core should be tight. And we're just curling up all the way up. Almost a full sit-up. Keeping that core tight the whole time. Drive right back up. Keep one of the back is extended here. Keep that core tight. Don't let it loosen up. Suckers! Squeeze it, squeeze it. Five more. Stronger. And time. That's a round. We're going to repeat that same round. You're a little, that was just the first set to get warmed up. So we're going to repeat that group again two times in a row, straight through with no break after you just stretch it out. Get hydrated because we're barely just getting freaking started. So get stretched, shake it out, hydrogenate, and get ready to repeat that round. Easy stuff. So that was six exercises. This round we're going to run through it straight through two times. So the second we finish that core set, we're flipping that BOSU ball right back over and going to push-ups. That's going to be right after the plank jacks, right after the crunches, flipping it right back to push-ups to make it that second round, well really third round, but second round this, this, this set, more freaking challenging. If you have any questions, comments, put them down below. If you're watching this on YouTube, make sure you're subscribing to the channel. Put some questions, share this with your friends, your family, your co-workers. Put some comments, yeah, I need any help with any, put it below. You need to get set up a nutritional consultation. Just put your information below or send me a private message and we will get right back to you. Give me send me your email address and we will get rolling. Send it in the a private message with your email address. All right, let's roll. Let's do it. Rounds two and three of group A. Starting with our push-ups. Push-ups. Go, pump it. Breathe out as you're pushing up. Body straight line. Stiff as a board. What are you on, boy? Whatever you're on my No, I was going much faster than you. And you stopped and I didn't stop. Minus five, minus six, minus seven, minus eight. Time. All right, get your monster band. You have a thicker one? Pull out a thicker one for this round so you have more tension. Shit, I think this one's too thick, but oh well. I may squat down and not get back up. Fuck that. Drive it. Push it up. Into the nose down. Drive it up. Back is totally straight. Sit back on your hips and heels. Brace those abs. Into the nose down, out the mouth up. Quads, glutes. Your head is up though, your arms are working just to hold that band in place. A few more. If you don't have a band, you just do hold a dumbbell, hold a medicine ball. Do freaking body weights, do it at a little faster pace if you have to. If you have a thicker band, you should be using a thicker band at this point. You're done warming up. Time to get to work. Time. Medicine ball. Hitting our slam. 
or regular slam. Let's go right to it. You know what this stuff is by now. If you don't have a ball, you're just doing a chop with your weight or with whatever. Smash it. Breathe it out. Hard as you can. Go as fast a pace as you can. Burn this out. Pumping it. first this time. So left leg is back, right leg is forward, left arm. Two press, swing out, two row. You should have this rhythm down. Press, press. It's just fast. Palm could even be in for the press, whatever. It's just a fast pace. Almost a punch. We want a pace on this. Pump in the chest and tries. Pump in the back and buys. Getting that left arm. Pump the hell up! Two and two! Swing it! Non stop! So that arm fucking falls off! Get as much tension on that band as you can handle. This should be a challenge. You shouldn't just be pushing air. It should be tension. As much tension as you can handle to keep this pace. And keep swinging it out. Time, switch, right arm. So your right leg is back, left leg is forward. Row, row, step in, press, press, swing out 180. Two rows, step in, two press. So it's 180 degree movement. The row is going completely straight forward, or the press, and the row, complete opposite direction. Two, two, let's go. Yeah, you got a rhythm going, come on. Push it fast, ha, ha. Swing, a lot of tension. Pump that fucking arm up. Not like spaz. Unlike some people. I ain't saying no names. But it rhymes with ridge and fridge. And bridge. And bridge. Time. Bosu ball, plank jacks, and crunch. Go, plank jacks. Go. Feet jump apart together. Back is totally straight. Chest, shoulders, and tries are locked in place. Lighten your feet. On the balls of your feet. Spring in your step. Stop, stop, stop. Five, four, three. Going to an upper crunch. Upper crunch. If you're at the right, if you find the right position on this, your abs, right, this bottom position, should be super freaking tight. Go, crunch. Or just do them on the floor. Yeah, I'm not in the right position. You don't need super tension on your abs. Pause it up. Squeeze, control down. Support your neck if you need to, but keep your eyes on the ceiling. So your arms are getting a break, because we're flipping it right back over to repeat this round. Right when this set's over, we're going right back to mother flipping push-ups. Two more. Time. Flip it over. Crawl into position like a little freaking baby. What is that? What kind of... Right away, flip it. Right to your freaking push-ups. Go, bang them out. I want to see 20. 20, go! Five. Ten. Chest to the board. Fifteen. Nineteen. Twenty. Put that place, that ball aside. Get your heavier monster band out. Right away. 
Get inside. Trap yourself inside that sucker. Elbows in. Right below your chin, right to your squat. Go. If you have a heavier band, you should be using it now. Or heavier dumbbell. Or whatever you're using. Or, or just walk away. Go to the pisser. <laughs> Breathe it out. In through the nose, down. Out through the mouth, up. Abs are tight, head up. Chest out. Control that band. Resist down. Don't let it fling you down, otherwise it's gonna press you down. Drop it up. A few more. Time! Fling that crap aside. Get your monster or your medicine ball out. Your slams. Get your monster balls out. Donkey Kong balls. Go, go! Smash it. Look, if you have something you can't smash, you're just here. Boom, down fast, strong. If you have neighbors underneath you, smash the floor even freaking harder. Screw them. They need to get their asses off the couch. They need to turn off the damn Netflix and get to work. Smash it, boom. Few more. Last three. Time. Go to your band for those row and pivot press. Let's go. Right on first this time. Pull for two. Step back and press for two. Spin. Pull. Pull. Spin in. Press. Press. Spin out. Pull. Pull. Spin in, press, press. Find the rhythm, and then get a little pace going. Shh, shh. off that foot. Make sure you're not twisting your knee, and keep pumping it out. Swing it, boom, boom. There it is. Who's interrupting? Tennessee. Sorry, person from Tennessee. You're gonna have to wait. Tennessee. Pump it. Time. Switch left arm. Left arm. Right leg forward. Left leg. Nope. Yep. Right leg stays in place. Swing the left leg out. Pull, pull. Swing the left leg forward. Press, press. The right leg stays in place here. Don't forget on the Instagrams and the Twitter twats and, and Facebooks and all that stuff. They're showing you everything backwards. This is my left hand that I'm putting out the band with right now. This is my right leg that I'm pivoting on. Swing it. Boom, boom. Yeah, good break there. Missed like nine and a half sets. Pump it, swing, press, press, swing out, pull, pull, swing in, press, press, swing out, pull, pull, high. Back to push the ball to finish off the round for the plank jackers and the upper crunchers. Let's go. We're going to 30. Three, two, one, go. gym you're in. Don't be some disrespectful savage just throwing shit around and ruining shit. And you'll be the same one to complain that shit don't work and shit is broken. 
Cut that shit out. That ain't cool. You deserve a slap in the back of the fucking head. Oh. Yeah, yeah. And if you think I'm talking to you, you're probably right, suckers. And guess what? It's a free class. Come play to management. <laughs> <laughs> Who is the management? I don't know. You are. You are. Wait, what? Pause the top position. Squeeze it. Squeeze. Neck training. Go harder. Curl up. A few more. This is it for the round. Three more. One. Two. Time. Time. Shake it. So there's going to be a whole new group coming up. That same template, start with the push-up. The push-up's only going to stay the same with the monster band, medicine ball, all that good stuff. We're going to do it for one round, and then a break, and then rounds two and three with no break. So you got to break right now, stretch your shoulders, stretch your freaking quads. Back. Stretch your back out. Your hips, glutes, hammies, hamsters, hamstrings, chicken strings, all that good shit. Hamsters. <laughs> Set your shoulders. Get the chest ready. The only thing staying the same is going to be the push up. It's starting with the push up again, the most ball. Every round, start with that push up. We want some freaking reps of those. And then, from there, it's all the same pieces of equipment, the same order, the same template. We're just switching up the exercises. So from there, we go to the monster band. The monster band's gonna have a shoulder press. The exercise band is gonna have buys and tries. We're going about 15 seconds. Huh? Start like seven, seven minutes. Seven minutes. Hydrate and get ready to roll. I think we did a lot of sets there. We did a whole warm up with the bands, all the rotator cuff, all the regular bands. That round was 18 sets. This round, you know, it's six exercises times three rounds. Wow. All right, let's get ready. Wow. Push ups. Going in three. I want freaking 20. Three, okay. two, one, go. Five, keep the back straight, core tight. Ten. Fifteen. Fifteen. Twenty. Time. Get your exercise band out. If you have a thick one, you can try it. You might need to go down to a thinner one, so we're going all the way overhead. You're gonna stretch the shit out of it. I'm gonna try this thick one. It's a pretty tight one. It's like a thick black okay. one. So okay. you're in here, bend, bend, bend. and we're pushing overhead. But I want, come on, come on. if okay. you have a thin band, look, I want speed. If you don't have a band, just use your dumbbells, medicine ball, whatever. Pump it out, pump for a few. If you have to recover at the bottom, recover. If you have a shitload of tension on the band like this one, But we want to push through it with a little tempo to get that freaking heart rate jacked up. Boom. Boom. Recover. Time. Fuck that burn my shoulders out. I did like 10. Oh yeah. Huh? I did like 10. I did like 10. All right. Go to your medicine ball. We're going twisting slam. Look. You don't have a ball, you're just going to twist and chop and bend down, come all the way overhead, pivot and bend. If you have a ball, you're just, boom, twist, 180 degrees, pivot and slam, bash it. Twist and boom. Breathe it out as you're smashing it down. All the way overhead. Pump it. Smash that 
sucker. Break it. Put a hole in the fucking ground. Band. Check it out, you're going two bicep curl, two tricep, two tricep kickback. Two tricep. In stride. Go, 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 go. So look, feet are straight across. Squared up. You're going one, two, kick back for one, two, up high in your ear. One, two by, palm down, elbow each side, two try. Your arms should already be pumped up. Blasting. Two by, two try, suckers. Look, smooth transition. You never stop moving. So this, even this, something so simple, especially if you're babbling like me, should get your freaking heart rate up. And we're doing a lot of them. Pumping the shit out of your arms. Switch the left arm. Did someone run over a, a gerbil over here or something? <laughs> something like a gerbil that I put on a uh, Empire Stippling and run over a garbage truck. Bicep. Two. Tricep. Two. Look, find that pace. Pump it. Fuck yeah. Pumping those arms up. Getting the heart rate up at the same time because of the tempo. You have no tension. You have to get back. Tight, pump it. Ha, 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 ha. Bosu ball has mountain climbers. Mountain climbers with the Bosu ball. Push up position. Mountain climbers. Going in three, two, one, go. Going to 50 total. 12, 13, 16, 18, 20, 22, 32, 42, 52, 50 freaking zero. Oh no, we gotta flip the boat all over. You're gonna sit your ass up on top of the ball, your hands behind you, either on the floor or on the ball. I guess depending on the size, your ass is gonna determine where you're gonna put your hands, because yeah. if you got a big ass, big ass ass, you ain't gonna have no room for your hands. So I'm gonna put my hands on the floor to make way for my rather large gluteus asimus. <laughs> Let's go. And we're pumping flutter kicks. Just find a position for your arms that work for you. Mine work to the sides. Because if I go too far back, it puts this strange stretch on my breasticles. So I'm just going to lean back here and put my hands to the sides. This works for me. Just keep the back straight. We're going to 50. And I don't know how many that is. Because I was babbling. I was babbling about gluteus asimus and breasticles. So let's go 20 more. Two. Four. Six. Eight. Ten. 12, 14, I will fuck my legs. Playing my abs. My fucking quads. Fuck that. It's 20. That was 20. I don't care what you say. I'm going to make you 100. You go to knock yourself out. You're going to be comfortable. All right, so that's round one of this group. You're going to take a break, and you know what's going to happen. We're going to do the same thing we did last round. We're going to repeat that round, but do it twice straight through with no break. So instead of six sets in a row, it will be 12 straight sets. And by this point, you should be pumped up. Like, I could feel... My arms are freaking pumped right now. My arms are pumped. The gluteus asimus is pumped. The breasticles are pumped. Feeling good. Shake it out. Stretch it. Hydrate it. Catch your breath. I'm getting more out of breath from fucking talking than I am from doing the sets. But So if you ever need to get extra cardio, just don't shut up. Just start screaming nonstop like a psychopath and you'll probably burn some more calories. Tip, Fit tip of the day. Scream like a psychopath while you're working out. And you'll burn more calories. That is, that is scientifically proven. That is scientifically proven to be the case. By a non-scientist. Just like in Norbit. If you ever watched Norbit. If you didn't watch Norbit, you're missing out. And it was scientifically proven that Norbit moved. 
that car, that, 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 that driver's seat closer to the steering wheel. It was scientifically proven, according to Respucia. Who knows who Respucia is? Eddie Murphy. No, not if it's Eddie Murphy. I just mean the character. No, he was both of them. He played Respucia also. He also played the father, the grand, the guy who adopted them. Makeup and Hollywood makeup stuff. No, but how can you both uh, Respucia and Norbert at the same time? Cameras on them? Oh. Where they were cameras? He cloned himself. Maybe he cloned himself. <sighs> Stretch it. Stretch those hips. Really Stretch your shoulders. Hips. Stretch the chest. We are getting ready. So you're repeating that same round. And it was a, it was a, a, a rough round on the upper body. And on the breathing, so now we're going two times straight in a row. It's going to be 12 straight sets. You get ready. We're going in a couple seconds. So suck it up. Finish hydrogenating. And you know we start with 20 push-ups. And then don't forget, after the end of the round has the mountain climbers and then the flutter kicks, and then you have to flip right back over for the third set of push-ups. That ought to be fun. Your ass over. What is this? Nappy time? This ain't romper room. What does that mean? Move. Flip. Go, go, Some go. Dumb kids show when I was a kid. I'm in Channel 13. Oh, right before room? Sesame Street. Yeah. What the heck is Sesame Street? Uh oh. What's who's going Push ups. <laughs> going in three, two, one. one. Go. I want to see 20 suckers. <laughs> ah. Two. Fifteen. Twenty. Listen, do modify push-ups if you need to, but don't do push-ups from your freaking knees. Because that is scientifically proven also by Professor Norbit that push-ups on your knees do not make you stronger. We used to let people do push-ups on their knees for years and years, and after two, three years of doing push-ups on their knees, they still could not do one single full freaking push-up. Why'd you let them do regular push-ups on their knees? That used to be the way we did it until we learned. You learn your lessons and you get better and you improve and you move on and you change things to make it better. And, and so you know then what? you can spread the world about it. Spread the world? Spread the world about it. Spread the world. Spread the world. Don't we have the entire world? Show the press. Spread the world. Pump it out. What's spinning all like right now? Pump it, pump it. We're going to burn the shit out of these shoulders this round. Because I want it a pace enough that it gets you out of breath. Let it burn the muscles, but it also gets you out of breath. You need to stop at this bottom for a second. There's still a shitload of tension on your arms and your core. Three, four, five, and hold. Ha! Ah, five more, five more, come on. One, two, three, mother flipper! Mother flipper! Flip that damn rubber. That rubber band will bust your ass if you bring it heavy enough. And you bring it. All right, medicine ball. Twist slam. You're jumping over. Boom. Ride the wave. Whatever side you're slamming to, the opposite foot should be pivoting on the ground. Pivot and smash. Let's go. A few more. Each side. Oh right God. in the wave. Screw that shit. Bang. The B tree. The B tree set. B tree. B tree. B the tree. Bye, try. Well, move. Move to the so we'll Pump it out. Two B, two tree. Two B, two tree. Jinx. Uh. Pump it out. If you need more tension, just step back. If you need less tension, just step forward. I'm like you. I'm like you. 
If you need some tension, step somewhere. Why <laughs> sit? Switch, switch arms. But now you're going to that arm is ready to pop. Okay. Till your bicycles are ready to just to <laughs> pop like a bicycle tire. And then your tricycles are just freaking exploding. <coughs> uh oh. <coughs> I'm choking on spit. It must be the Coronas. The other day, I was in, where was I? I don't know, somewhere. somewhere. And you had to wear the stupid mask. So I was drinking some water out of a water bottle. So you have to put your little mask down. I don't wear a mask often unless I'm forced to. If it's somewhere you just absolutely have to. And I started choking on my water because I'm trying to think of the stupid fucking face diaper. It doesn't mean stop. Drinking the stupid face diaper on. So I started choking on my own water. Everyone around me started running for the doors. They thought they were trapped inside the post office with a freaking patient zero. It was entertaining. Pump it. You're not allowed to cough anymore in this country. Pretty soon, coughing will be illegal. You won't be allowed to cough in public. You won't be allowed to sneeze. Eventually, you won't be able to uh, blink your eyes or breathe the motherfucking air. It's going to be banned. It's banned unless you have all kinds of shots in your butt cheeks to say you're safe to breathe the air and you're safe to blink your eyes in this country. All right. What are we on? Bubble bubble. We're on the bubble bosu? Bosu Mountain Climbers! Go! 50. Wrong. We're much higher than 16. You were kept it all fucking wrong, man. 30. You no idea where you are now because you're counting all kinds of random shit. Let's go 20 more. 1, 2, 4. Eight, twenty, zero. Flip it over. You said don't all the Flutter kicks. Flutters. Put your hands on your butt. My butt's saying so I put my hands on my butt. If your butt's covered, no boost the ball. Go, pump it. It out. Brace those abs. Back is straight. Legs are straight-ish. 20 more. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10. Throw! Heart, tears, peck, hey, 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 penny, zero! Flip that sucker over. And your arms and core are nice and tired. You should be out of breath. And you're going to write your push-ups for 20 freaking more. 20 more suckers! Does that mean 40? I should have You know, drugs boy. Push ups, go! Wait, 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 wait. You. Five. Come on, come on. Ten. Ten. Fifteen. Time. All right. Good, good, good. This is rubber band. Thick rubber band shoulder step. It's gonna be flipping awesome. Gonna be flipping awesome. Suck it up, you little bitch. I'm not talking to you, freaks. Talking to myself. I would never speak to you, suckers like that. You just said suckers. Oh, my bad. It's a free show. Please manage me. Go. Pump it out. Oh my god, that's fucking heavy at this point. Feels good. Feels good. I'm gonna go in sets of five. Sprint for five. Big deep breath. Now pump for five. Come on. Holy shit. Even a stupid rubber band with just a shoulder press will jack up your freaking heart rate. Five. Holy sucker. Five more. To make it 20 or 25, I don't even know where we're on anymore. Who cares? Five more. Go. I don't know how much I was pumping the last one. But it was pumping something. Pumping something. Ah. Ball slam. Ball slam. Twist ball slam. Let's do it. And okay. Don't hit me. boom. Boom. Ah. I see holes in the concrete. I want that ball to slam right through the floor and land down your neighbor's freaking bowl of Cheerios.
or in their big bucket of nuttery buttery popcorn as they're sitting there watching their nutter flakes. Don't watch Yellowstone. Flip it. Man. Watch. And we're going to the Yellowstone mountain climbers with the Y. Mountain climbers. Yes, she's no, awesome. Bye, That's try. Right. Oh, bye, shy. Yes, she's lots of pickles. I got confused with talking about them in the middle of interruptions, but I was rudely interrupted. She did some Yellowstone drill. Pickles, <laughs> lots of pickles. Pickles and cocaine. No, copy some. Let's go. Ready? Bye. All right, left arm first. Ah, right, whatever. Just go. Bye. Try. Hi. B, tree. Bump in for two. Lean over, kick back for two. Burning those arms out. Oh yeah. We are feeling good. Time for you to work a little harder. Pump it. I want that arm. I want those muscles to be peeling through the damn skin. Bicycles and tricycles, sucker. Switch. Right arm. Pump or two. Hey. Now get spastic. In a good enough pace that you're getting that heart rate up there. Pumping it. Abs tight when you're leaning over. So you're not straining your lower back. Blast it out. Get air and lift it up. It's all swollen. Oh, yeah. It does. They breathe better. They make strips even the tape that pulls your nose up. You can have like breathing problems. Feel like where to go to sleep. Get some more air in there. All right. Let's go. Bosu. Bosu. Mountain climbers. Mountain climbers. Mountain climbers. We're going fitty. Fitty of them. Going in three, two, two one, one, go. Two, two, four, hit, six, hit, head, go, fourteen, sixteen, eighteen, twenty, two, four, six, eight, forty, two, four, six, eight, forty, two. For 50 freaking flutter nutters. Nutter kicks. Go to the butts. <laughs> Lean back, tighten up those abs, straighten the freaking legs, and kick it. Let's go. Two, four, ten, eighteen, twenty, two. Tense on the abs the whole time. Thirty-two. Six. Eight. The hell are you doing? Four, two, and four. Six. Eight. Fifty zero. Hi. No one now listen up, freak shows. If you did those hard enough, that's all you need to do. Here's what you need to do if you realize it took you a little while to catch on before you're able to get to work. My shirt is completely soaked because we're freaking putting out. So. Yeah, pure slime, pure slime, look at that. But here's what you can do. If you wanted to do a bonus round because it took you the first round or two to get into the flow, to catch on, to figure out your piece of equipment, what you could do is take all the first six exercises, combine it with the second six, and do a set of 12 as an additional round. If you wanted to add this, or that could even be its own separate workout another day. You just take this recording, do a full round, 12 straight exercises, all the first six, right away to the second six as a set of 12. You do that a couple times straight through. That's all you need to do. And you can substitute any one of these pieces of equipment. So anyway, if you need help with your fitness, your nutrition, just send me a private message. Let's talk. We can get you on some supplementation if you need any help with any supplements, meal replacements, energy, hydration, 
between Herbalife and Trulene. We have all of that covered. You could literally have so much in nutrition covered automatically taking the guesswork out, taking all the garbage, artificial shit that you're having, and you can add that into your daily routine. So just send me a message if you need help with that. Anyway, put a questions, comments down below. Make sure you share this with your friends, your family. Send me a message if you need any help. If you want to talk about private coaching, if you want to talk about the project or the Herbalife and Trulene supplements, send me your private message. Put a message down below and share this video. And in case no one told you yet today, you are fucking awesome. No excuses. Freak shows. Anything you want to tell to find freak folks. Yeah! Very, very normal children. I can't imagine where to get from. I will talk to you later. You are freaking awesome. No excuses.